to me, there's no reason that our team members shouldn't be able to make additional money each month. They all need it. They all want it. We've been misled to believe that dentistry, more specifically the dental business, has to be complicated. Dentistry can be simple and dentistry should be simple. Hey gang, we're back and this is two weeks in a row. I feel bad that we have to keep starting these, these counters <laughs> up again. I don't know what's going on. It's just been it's been a busy summer, and now that we're getting into fall, yeah. Uh, and then I'm going to build a studio in my garage. Yeah, so I think that'll help out. You just moved. That was also a big. Yeah, job. I get. I forgot about that. Right. That, yeah. That it does. That moving is a lot of work. I know. I'm trying to rearrange rooms right now, and just moving within <sighs> your own house is a lot. Yeah, I know. For me to move around from my bedroom to the kitchen <laughs> is a lot of work. I mean, like furniture. It's very cleaning easy out for, rooms. I mean, let me tell you, cleaning out a closet is very hard. I've never done such a, I, I clean out a closet. I just throw everything I away. I know. I know what but, you do. Like for me to move, moving from my, from the couch to my bedroom seems to be very difficult. <laughs> moving from That's the couch, a problem. couch to the kitchen seems very easy. <laughs> yes. And going from the bedroom to the bathroom, like super easy. Yeah. <laughs> so. Yeah. Gets, gets uh, easier and easier. Well, in the last episode, we talked a lot about. You mean episode 383? Yeah. I don't know what number is there, but we talked about. Um, strategic planning, and we mentioned we kind of wrapped it up with a scorecard to help track all of this planning. Scoreboard. Scoreboard, scorecard, yes, all those things that kind of track all of these new planning initiatives. And you said something about, um, what did you say? Incentives? Yeah, strategic Just, incentives. Yeah, you said other incentives that yeah. were that we're tracking. And so I kind of wanted to ask you, pick your brain about those extra incentives and what those were. Are they things for the team, for the practice? Um, where are these numbers coming from? I just think a lot of doctors, when asked these types of questions, they aren't really sure. And so when it comes to team bonuses and that kind of thing, they just give away without, and we've seen this in the mastermind, yeah. without kind of working backwards and finding the numbers. So I yeah. thought um, if they're not ready for the full So basically we're going to talk about team bonuses. Yes. Okay. Yes. All right. Yeah. So number one. Or what those extra initiatives that are that you do. Yeah. So, so I'm happy to talk about those things. Um, uh, number one, I'm not perfect. Okay. My way is not the only way. And it's not that my way works all the time either. Okay. Yeah. But I'm very confident that my way is sound business. Yeah. And I think from seeing it now in 75, 80 practices that at least a half of this, half of these ways um, have worked pretty well. Yeah. So, so here's what I will say. Uh, first, any bonus plan, any bonus plan in your dental practice has to come on the heels of being a healthy business. Right. Okay? And what I mean by healthy business, you're a profitable business after you pay yourself like a normal associate dentist. Right. There has to be a certain amount of profitability there. At that point, then you can have a bonus system. Mm -hmm. And your bonus systems systems mm -hmm. have to be rooted in some form of objective data. Right. It can't be, oh, I, I want to do this, so I'll just make my number this. Yeah. It, it can't be, oh, last year we did 100 a month, so this year I want to do 110. It, it can't, it, it shouldn't be that. I'm not saying it can't be that. It, right. It shouldn't be that, okay? So in our practice for 2025, we're, we're going to have three incentive programs in the office, mm -hmm. okay. The first one is 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 bam, our goal. Right. What are you laughing at? No, I'm just I'm just thinking. <laughs> You're freaking me out a little bit with the laughing, but that's okay. Uh, our bam system it, for us, the bam is our monthly revenue goal in the practice. Yeah. Okay. So for us, it'll be around three hundred, three twenty five. Will be three hundred. Let's call it three hundred k. Will be our monthly monthly revenue goal. Okay. Right. And so then the team will share in a bonus above that number. Right. Okay. So anything up to the three hundred they get they, they get their normal pay. And then everything above three hundred, a certain percentage will go into a pot that's split amongst the team members. Right. Okay. So and, and I want this to be the majority of the bonus system. Mm -hmm. Because what I know that when we hit our our calculated goal. Right. And our goal is our, our goal is calculated. It's not just a made up number. Right. Okay, it's calculated based on team overhead being at twenty to twenty five percent, depending on your market and your practice makeup. In my case, twenty five percent. That if we hit that number, 
I will have a healthy practice. Right. I will have a healthy practice. Right. Okay. So that that's I don't just make up the number. I don't just say, oh, it's this. I don't have some consultant tell me this or this office has it's it's a number based on my cost of doing business uh, and, and keeping a healthy business. Right. Okay. And I want that to be, say, let's call it 50, 60 percent, 70 percent, at least two thirds of the potential uh, additional earned income, extra team revenue uh, that we have. Okay. The second thing, let me go to the third thing we have. Okay. The third thing I've had in place, I've done many different times, and that's having a monthly, what I call free bonus. Okay. In okay. other words, non-production based bonus. And so like, for example, right now, uh, if we get 20 Google reviews and five patient test video testimonials, uh, I will put, uh, I think it's $500 in the pot for the team to split. That works out to be 50 bucks a person. Mm-hmm. Uh, I'll put maybe at six hundred dollars in the pot. It's twelve people, so uh, I put six hundred dollars in the pot. They get split up amongst everybody. All they got to do, whether we make one dollar or not, is if we get twenty Google reviews, and we get five video testimonials published on YouTube. Mm-hmm. Okay, then we will unlock that six hundred dollars in the pot shared amongst the team. Right. Okay. So I believe uh, that incentive is important because. Those things, Google reviews, video testimonials, social media postings, as you know, X number of patient referrals, whatever it is, right. those things, if we do those things right, that will feed All right, that's, a healthy business. I and mean, I want to say free, but now it's $600 of marketing. Yeah, right. But, <laughs> but, but it's free marketing, but it's, you know? But it's $600. I'll pay right. $600 for yeah. that marketing any day of right. the week. Right. Any day of the week, right? So- any day of the month, yeah, not the week, <laughs> yeah. but the month, right? Right. So, so, so to me, that's my non-production bonus. That's number three. Mm-hmm. Okay. Number two is a quarterly clinical focus. Okay. Okay. So for us right now, in the, a night, I could, let's call it a ninety-day challenge. Right. So that's a quarter. So right now we're doing a quarterly clinical challenge on Clear Aligner Orthodontics, in right. our case, Candid Pro. Like we have an incentive set up where. So again, with me, incentives are always fair to the business and fair to the team. Right. Okay. It's got to be both. And there's always, so there's always like a limit or a pot or a certain amount. There's no limit, but there's a minimum. Right. Okay. Yeah. So in, in the ortho side. Uh, by limit, I mean like um, it's $600 or like you're willing to put in this amount of money. Yes. Yes. It's not, right. it's, it's a very clear defined right. goal, right? Yes. So in our case, what we're doing on our 90 day clear liner candid pro challenge is Number one, each month, that one, right. it's a it's a quarterly thing, okay? But we have to average a minimum of two per month. And we've just made this up as like a game. So yeah. people can make their own. This is the first time we've done this type yeah. of game. Yeah, so this is the first time. But it's, it's yeah. I can already see the excitement about right. it. Right. So I like it. So in the past, we've done like a bingo and like yeah. some other games, but this is a new one. Yeah, so, so basically the first two are for the practice. Right. Okay, the first two cases each month are for the practice, okay? okay? Each additional one beyond that, um, the the team uh, I I put in two hundred and fifty bucks uh, into a pot for the team. Right. Okay. So if they do five cases, those that case three, four, and five will unlock two hundred and fifty dollars per case that goes into the pot for the team. Okay. Okay. And the way they get this, and this was Hetrick's idea, they're doing poker chips. Yeah. So they're all numbered. So they get. I don't. I don't understand. I yeah. understand poker. Yes. And I understand, this doesn't have I anything to do with poker. I understand casino chips. We just use the chips because they have yeah. the dollar amount on them. And then so they get. I get, they draw. They, get, they draw a certain number, but I put basically the yes. equivalent of two hundred fifty dollars worth of poker chips in a pot per but case. But to make above it fun, two. some team members may get more than others. Yeah. Depending on what they draw. Yeah. Exactly. Some might get a hundred dollars. Some might, might get, get five. Ten dollars. Right. Yeah. Yeah. So that's our quarterly goal. It's done on a monthly basis, but that's our quarterly focus for the last Q4, the 90-day challenge for the Q4 of 2024. Yeah. And then around December 1st, I'll start coming up with another quarterly focus for Q1 2025, which may be, in our case, uh, orthodontics again, or it may be number of single tooth implants we do. It may be extraction graphs. But what, by by rotating these things around, we revitalize certain yeah. areas of our practice and there's a lingering effect. Right. It's not like we're going to focus on ortho and then just drop it. Drop We've it. gotten used to talking about ortho. Right. But if you don't, if I don't bring it back every six months or so, I can, yeah. six to nine months, 
if I don't bring it back at, at least once a year, it will taper right. off. So we've done sleep before. We've yeah. done that lots of Yeah, we've of done times. sleep. We've done all kinds of stuff. Yeah. yeah. So so that's kind of where – so we have three ways that yeah. team members can earn extra income. Uh, the main way is through a healthy business, BAM goal, mm-hmm. meeting revenue goals. Uh, number two is a quarterly clinical focus. Right. Again, okay, ninety day challenge. And number three is uh, what I call free. Like this is stupid if you don't make it. Right. Like this is pure laziness, which they didn't make it in September, which irritated the f, f- out of me. Okay. <laughs> and in this for this non production bonus, we've done this a lot of different ways yeah, too. We've done. Um, yeah, go ahead. But sometimes what's fun is to like earn an event. Yeah. Like, hey, if we hit this, we'll all go get pedicures across the street as a team. I need a med- nope. I need a pedicure. By yeah. The way. So we should do that. <laughs> me too. Yeah. Can I get one before I go into labor? Can we do yeah, a team well, of it? Yeah, I'm, um, I'm not sure I want to see if you're all oh, they're, pregnant. And they're stuff. great. I'm not Jesse. Okay. Was just, I'm tall. I'm, I'm good. Um, we had a team member that swelled on her. Fo- I don't know what happened to her foot, man. <laughs> Holy shit. We have like pictures of her in the office with her feet just because they were so swollen. Um, but we, a lot of times we've done different things. And so we've earned different events. We've done, so that becomes two for one, right? Yeah. Because- Culture, like we talked yep. about, team morale and team culture. When you do things together like that outside of the oh, man, office, we went to that jumping place a couple of yeah, months I ago. Yeah, I mean, we we try trampoline. to do a month. I got a headache or, from that. We try to do a quarterly event together, anyways. Yeah, but I think a pedicure or something, some tor- sort of service, a massage or something that's a little bit more expensive can be an earned. Yeah. Um, and pedicures are expensive now because I get the luxury package. Yeah, but we can do basic. Like I get the, what is that, that cream? Bougie or, but basic. So they do like a... a like Massage? A, like you it? pick like the, the Exfoliator. Different. Oh, yeah, yeah. They probably have a good... I think um, they use sandpaper on me. I was going to say, I think we have a really good place across the street that's like a, it's called the foot spa, not just pedicures. It's Asian. But I, I bet you they have like a pumpkin spice. That's what all the girls would want right now. Oh, I'm out. <laughs> um, so anyways, we've talked about the extra team bonuses um quite a few times and i know i've mentioned this but i always like to mention i've never seen the girls work together mm-hmm. so like all of us work in sync together so well yeah. as there is when they're when we are looking at the scorecard and seeing we only need two more cases yeah. or let's get two more cases but that's the why the scoreboard is so important right is so that or, people know where they stand hey let's you know it's irritating me we cases, don't have a scoreboard right now it's driving right. me i don't know how it disappeared, but it disappeared. Yeah. Somebody must have taken it home with them. It's just shit's getting back put up. Good. Tomorrow. Tomorrow. It's already up. No, it's up point. tomorrow. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, by the time this episode's coming yeah. up, it's, it should be It better up. be up. It better, better be We'll up. have a follow-up on that. But I just have never seen them, you know, hey, we need to get $20,000 this week. You know, that's a lot easier than let's wait till the end and, oh, no, we still need $100,000. Yeah. Or at this point, we need tw- an extra 20000 yeah. a week than what's scheduled. Let's close some cases. Let's close a couple of big cases, um, especially hygiene. That's where they, you know, you talked about their number not really changing much because there's only. Not from the direct production. Right. Yeah. But that's where they can really step up is help with um, closing cases and be more of a partner in the practice so that we can hit these goals and there be a healthier business to share more. That's the game. So. so- I hope you found uh, this helpful and uh, insightful and maybe sparks, uh, sparked some ideas for you guys uh, to do that. And so to me, whether we hit the BAM or not, uh, to me, there's no reason that our team members shouldn't be able to make additional money each month. They all need it. They all want it. Uh, through our quarterly clinical focus and our monthly quote-unquote free uh, non-production bonus. So um, the BAM, if you do those things well, the BAM should take care of itself. All right, everybody, have a wonderful day and wonderful week, and let us know how we can help you at 3D Dentists. And don't forget to join our community, pro.3d-dentist.com, or go on your favorite app store and search 3D Dentists, and the app will show up.